Chronic pain is a subjective sensory and emotional experience for the patient that can be manifested in many different ways. The key being that it has two components. One, a sensory component, which is what the patient experiences, and the second component being an emotional component in terms of how that affects their emotional well-being. The field of pain medicine is evolving at a very rapid pace. Developments in technology, as well as an understanding of certain conditions, has led to the ability to treat patients in a way that we never have before. And we're privileged to have six world-renowned fellowship-trained faculty who are experts in the field of pain medicine. We also have a fellowship training program, which currently has six fellows. The fellowship training program enables us to teach the next generation of pain medicine physicians. It also keeps us on the cutting edge in terms of research and in terms of innovative new procedures that can further the field. Finally, at the University of Florida, we also have access to other disciplines that may aid in the assistance of care for a patient. And having easy access to other physicians within the system facilitates expedited care and the best level of care for our patients. As the field of pain medicine continues to evolve, the University of Florida is at the cutting edge of adding new procedures that add to our armamentarium or toolbox of things we can offer patients. Two of those procedures that are being implemented in the last year are the mild procedure for spinal stenosis, the Vertiflex inner spinous spacer, and also new modes of stimulation procedures that are very beneficial to many patients. With improved awareness and knowledge about some of the dangers of long-term and high-dose opioid therapy for chronic pain, we are always looking to develop new procedures, new technology, new innovative ways to treat people in chronic pain. The University of Florida is a center of excellence for not only clinical care, but research in order to develop some of those new therapies, and also teaching, teaching the next generation of pain physicians how to implement safe, effective, and novel therapies in their practices. Thank you.